Josh on Coast Mesa R&D. Well, today we have a pair of Harley Davidson cylinders that we're going to sleeve. And this one here we've already got bored out. And uh, I want to show you how we do this on the CNC mill. Uh, we've already measured our sleeve. It's 3 inches, 502 thousandths in diameter. We're going to bore this uh, 3.500. Uh, so we're going to have about 2 thousandths of press or so. And we've got a real simple solution to hold it on the mill. We use a pair of one, two, three blocks to hold up the sides. And we're using a couple of uh, bar clamps here to hold it down. As you can see, it's just a one event program on this. Um, we're going to drill. We set our X and Y at zero. We used a coaxial indicator to indicate our cylinder in. So that'll put us in the right position. We're going to minus down to 750. We're going to go a total depth of 7 inches, 555, or 550 thousandths. And we're not going to have any packs. We're going to have a speed of about 480. Feed rate is about 3 inches. And we're going to use tool number one, which is our boring tool, which is laying right here. All right, we're going to do this in two passes, which is what we like to do. We don't have all that much to take out, so here we go. Now, the rest of this is going to be pretty boring. You have to make sure that when you set the machine up that you have enough clearance here from your stud to the machine. And our first cylinder that we did, we actually had to take and move this over and recenter everything. But uh, this is one of the things that you learn when you do this. This cylinder had already been bored out quite large, so it's only got about, I think, about 50,000 to take out total. And yeah, we are going to bore all the way through the cylinder, and we'll bring the city down to here. And what we're going to do is we're going to take and drill a hole in here. And we're going to use a threaded paper pin in here like we use for crackers here so that the sleeve won't move up or down. Alright, we'll go ahead and readjust our tool. And then we'll be ready to come back and do the rest of this. Things about seven or eight thousandths out right now.
Well, there we have it. We're all bored out. All I have to do now is put the sleeve in, pin it, take it over to the hone, finish this job up. And it just shows you how you can use your CNC mill to bore cylinders. And if you make up a uh, boring head like we did, then it makes it much easier. John Coast Mace R&D. We'll see you soon.